Good morning, teachers. This is Mr. Navis here with another tech tip. This tip uh, is actually regarding your Power Teacher gradebook, and more specifically, on, is on how to uh, input your comments, your marking period comments, progress reports. Okay, so today's tutorial, I'm just going to show you. It's really, really easy how to enter comments through the gradebook. So uh, first things first. I mean, this screen should be uh, pretty familiar to you all um, you're gonna log into your power teacher once you log in you will see this screen uh, you're going to click here launch your gradebook once you launch your gradebook this also should look familiar uh, you're gonna see your classes up here um, categories and then pretty much your rosters um, in order to enter a comment, it's very, very easy. What you're going to do is make sure, please make sure, you're in the right term. Make sure you have this set to marking period 3. Uh, once that's set to marking period 3, uh, right under the score sheet, you're going to double-click where it says final grade. Double-click here. Once you double-click that, you're going to have a little box pop up. Uh, what you need to do is click this other tab. Uh, it defaults right to score, but if you click comment, you then open up the comments sheet. Now, in order to uh, add a comment, you're simply double clicking on a comment you want, and then all you're going to do is either one or two things. If you're done, you can either press close. If you want to go to the next student without having to go back here and double click each time, you can use these arrows up here. These arrows will actually scroll down through your roster and once again you're double clicking anything you any comment you want and you press close once you're done inputting your comments uh, very important you come down here press save uh, and that that that's it that's all you need to do um, there's no need to export there's no need to do anything like that you enter your comments again you double click final grade on any student you click your comment tab double click the comments you want click close and you are done. You then save the class so the com all the comments get saved and you can move on to your next class and keep inputting comments that way. Make sure, again, very important that the reporting term is set to the appropriate term. Uh, we are in the marking period three, so it should be set to Q3, okay? Um, this tutorial will be available on the YouTube page along with all the other tutorials. Uh, there are more tutorials coming in the near future. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to email me at this address. Um, and again, if you have any questions, please contact me. Thank you.